Welcome to Awakening News Channel, your source for Awakening News. Be sure to subscribe, share, and like our videos. And now, here is today's Awakening News. A post-event action plan, enhance and adapt these action steps according to your community's needs while adapting to the flow of what is required moment by moment as reality evolves. Be mindful that a calm, loving, and flexible presence will be a major attribute and necessity for a successful implementation of the plan and of great benefit to serving the needs of your community members. Immediately after the event commences, 03 hours in, contact TSG, Event Support Group, members to initiate distribution of the Community Leaders Brief CLB. Ask around for friends, family, neighbors, co-workers, or acquaintances that may be willing to help. If it is night time, Deliver the CLB and explain the situation to the police and fire chiefs and ask them to immediately call in off-duty staff along with the mayor, city council members. Establish contact with various levels of media, mainstream or alternative, local, national, or international to initiate the action plan for the event. Day 1. As soon as practical and for those that feel guided and capable. Please share the general facts with the media as highlighted in bold typeface in the link article link action plan for the event above. Deliver the CLB document, firstly to the mayor, city council, police and fire chiefs, then follow up with those deemed most responsible for informing the populace, directing community resources for maintenance of continued stability of needed supplies via the distribution system, and also keeping public areas safe for assembly. Utilize knowledgeable and balanced TSG members to provide additional verbal details as a group to the community's leaders, mayor, police, fire chiefs. If the community's leaders can't be reached promptly enough, consider approaching others who have probable communication access to them such as a locally elected city council member and or a deputy slash 2 and D in command to the police or fire chief. Reach out immediately to any contacts, friends, friends of friends, etc., who can provide an insider track to reach the movers and shakers. Deliver copies of the CLB to management of utility companies, grocery stores, hospitals, schools, and local businesses in cooperation with local authorities, chamber of commerce. Utilizing a mass CLB email to businesses, media, and ESG members, inform as many local residents as possible about the event, determine information sharing and community gathering suitability of pre-existing public address systems in school, community auditoriums, music, theater halls, movie cinemas, sports complexes, hotel conference centers, etc. If needed, set up public address systems at central locations to share info. Ask all informed residents to spread the word via friends, family, co-workers, and social media contacts by any and all means available. Overnight, day one, finalize public announcements content and determine the local authority, community members who will share the updates for residents. Organize plans for needed volunteer groups. Select individuals to interface with military contacts for any potentially required resupply of food, water, and basic subsides along with obtaining information updates. Day 2, if not begun on day 1, initiate public announcements at designated locations and if possible through local TV and radio stations utilizing the media action plan for the event info, CLB, and any situational updates available. Announce meet and greet locations for discussion and community potluck meals. In conjunction with local authorities determine necessary shorter and mid, long range needs. Contact and ask for assistance from all known local emergency response teams, along with environmental, political, and social activist type groups. Publicly state the immediate need for various volunteer committee members, begin registering new members, and provide needed direction, education, and support. A possible selection of volunteer committee focus groups to form current food and water supplies along with alternative sourcing methods and production. For example local spring water, alternative housing and shelters, for example churches, foreclosed, empty houses or warehouses, for the homeless, meet and greet gatherings and potluck meals. Go to National Night Out for ideas and resources, these are annual community gatherings which are often potlucks where everyone shares food and can socialize with neighbors food banks, food shelves, and delivery services such as Meals on Wheels critical basic subsidies, supply line maintenance, or acquisition of new alternative ones, swap meets for needed supplies, maintaining staff at critical infrastructure utilities, hospitals, and grocery stores, coordination and mobilization of all pre-existing local volunteer, charity, and activist groups, emergency response and conflict resolution teams, local militia groups to aid local law enforcement in maintaining order, emotional trauma, 
crisis counseling centers, energetic and body healing centers, multi-purpose slash capability roving student groups, social media outreach for education and assistance planning for nearby cities and towns, support for the elderly, disabled, and homeless, stress reduction, community artistic, free music slash theater slash dance performance, events, inspirational moral boosting, spiritual wisdom and guidance, think tanks for current and future planning and needed projects, day 3 and afterward, announce access to chosen locations and or phone numbers for drama centers and information updates, be creative in inspiring local businesses to remain open, report and limit price gouging and hoarding of essential goods, ask local businesses to accept checks, gold and silver, and alternate forms of payment, ascertain if the local or state, Province Chamber of Commerce can set up a script currency with local businesses, announce swap meets for needed goods, invite any local preppers to step forward to share extra supplies and help educate others, encourage residents to share what they have with others. In closing, the greater the level of preparation we can bring to the event followed by moving into right action, the faster useful info and guidance may be shared with community members. This will lead to a greater level of order, understanding, civility, and cooperation crucial for the optimal peace of mind and well-being of our fellow brothers and sisters. Please share this video with friends and loved ones. It is important that we be aware and not caught of guard. Awakening News Channel, Victory of the Light. Thank you for watching Awakening News Channel. We hope that you enjoyed it. Be sure to like us, share, and subscribe. See you next time.